Hate that little glitch. Uh, fuck, what is his full name? Yeah, PVT. There we go. Done. Zero, I want my go back. And we'll take away his health and be done like that. Yeah, default echo, five dollar spot. Thank you, my friend. I'll get you in the raffle. And yeah, there has been. Hey, Lyric, can I get a TP2 Ghost Warrior, please? Uh, DC. Yep, yep, I'll get that in. There has been some friendly fire today, but it hasn't been too much compared to what I've normally seen. I just gotta find Ghost Warrior now. Uh, if he decides to stop moving like that, we can get in Mr. FR. Hopefully he'll be able to then talk to him. Thank you, sure. Yeah, so he's going to follow the car. But, yeah, the friendly fire uh, hasn't actually been that high tonight. Sure, I've seen a few instances, but normally I think I've only seen about six... Five or six uh, KIAs to friendly fire. Normally, it's around 10 to 15 after the first mission. Especially, good God, especially, I hate to keep bringing it up, the, uh, the La Carado clusterfuck. There was a shit ton of friendly fire this is like a work complete announcement in that one. Heading to Vic location but yeah, friendly fire, to especially when you're hunting one guy, but then again, how could they know that? I can understand, because uh, what it sounded like was it was this Don't turret that fired, I heard that, shoot. And I'm willing to bet that he's on thermals on trying to spot me, mark. and he saw a thermal blip and decided to shoot it. Bravo. Which happens. Come on, this is Bravo. Go ahead. So now we're seeing... We're 300 meters so out from... We're 300 meters from the LV point. Can I just say how stupid this is of a formation? Charlie, come on. I mean, ahead, from Charlie. what I can make of it... 100 meters off uh, initial LZ for the cache. We have... I take that back, but I had to kind of find the formation here. So we got kind of going as a eight-man element team, a four-man team on the right, a four-man team on the left, kind of as reactive forces, and then a five-man team caboose and teacher in the middle. <laughs> But it looks like they're now reforming the massive blob formation. Honestly, the best ways to do these AOs is a tight line of people. Just have Blob Uno, Blob Dos, Blob Trace all move from the east and just comb this entire AO. And if you want to have reserve guys, great. Have them right behind the line and send them in where they're needed the most. Especially the medics. Because if the medic goes down in your squad, you're pretty much combat ineffective. Furthermore... What was going on up here when we had like five or six people trying to regroup? They should have honestly all quickly regrouped and then pulled back from the AO. We also have one guy. Yeah, you do that binoc thing. Charlie at the LV? Aye, aye, aye. Bravo at LV. Yeah, I mean, yeah, as Wargame said, that was almost like a point. platoon column. But, um. I'll fight LV. Oh, I know these guys don't do that on purpose. I know them too well. Furthermore, it's tier zero ops. I be advised you have friendly But see, they're, they're actually trying to do 360, watch roads. So there is some common sense being done here. It's just, again, if they trickle in slowly into an AO, as they've done time and time and before, they're not going to get this done. Because a lot of forces, I basically doubled the amount of infantry up here because a lot of them were able to pull out of that AO, and I just heard gunshot. Charlie, southeast. I don't see any aggro, but I definitely heard a gunshot. So I'm going to send a squad down in the direction of where the players are, where the source of that gunshot would have been. Alright, no, we'll send them over here, just in that direction. Charlie, you ready to push up with Bravo? Have them go in a line formation. Charlie, ready to push up, north side of the road? Do that, but I, Copy. We'll I know I heard the, something. Uh, left side of the road. It sounded like an AK, to be perfectly honest. That classic, like, cluck sound of, uh, you know, a single shot being fired.
I'm gonna have a chat with you later. Because how can you have that black AK if I know for a fact it's not in the arsenal? And I took out all of them two weeks ago because I knew... Charlie, the web. Well, that That's, definitely uh, sets aggro. Well, the patrol on the road, on the path. Rube immediately gets dropped. I'm gonna have a chat with ASF about that. We'll probably do it during the next debrief. I'll drag him up here and ask where he got it, because that is uh, it's a question I want to know. Otherwise, looks like they're starting to form a large blob, so slowly Zerg rush in. I'm going to send in reinforcements as best I can. I've got another squad to send, and I'm going to divert this two-man team over here. But by now, we should be guns up. These guys are judging the situation here. They need to be careful because they got friendly forces pushing up on the left. Zoho got dropped way in the back. Damn. I literally think that was just random suppressing Charlie, fire. What's your shit Having this Vic try to come in as best it can. Charlie, you read? You read? Here, I'm going to try to... Uh, I'm going to let this infantry team start taking contact again. We'll send this group up as well. Seek and destroy line formation full speed like that but yeah so far not a single casualty because we're dealing with lesser forces and I'm going to also have this group of four come in seek and destroy line formation Charlie, full. Charlie, so let's grab the driver you guys okay yep we're back up copy like a good spot to overwatch from. Alright, buddy, start dropping them. I believe in you. Pointed the gun to our right, possibly going for Nicholson. But again, seen a few casualties, but medics are popping smoke and getting on them. So it's a good mix. Rube has a squad lead. I don't know why he's pushed up so far ahead. Raptor NL and Stormwolf get outflanked. Alpha is moving south. He gets dropped. So Raptor gets killed. Have that 50 cal car kind of waiting. Oh, it's these reinforcements coming in. Otherwise, there's still a solid line of five people right here. But see how they're starting to split off now? So now we're going to have this force engage them first, pick them off. And the survivors are going to flank left while this 50 cal is now going to suppress these infantry. I'm just directing these guys to where the fire is. But I am also noticing that there is a good amount of tactics that are being Charlie, cited. Uh, Furthermore, they've got their own 50 cal they're bringing up from the rear. But this... Separation is going to create an issue. Uh, my team is, uh, still Whiskers there, but, uh, There's I'm another right instance down, of friendly fire. Place. Rainbow, oh, why did you fire in this direction where you ha- Ah, uh, whatever. Yeah, Lolo is now suppressing that direction. And Rainbow Slash actually got outright murdered, possibly by that 50 cal as he came back. So that's- That's justice. Or 40 Mike might go off. They managed to get up some of those casualties and swing some units around. Meanwhile, Xbox fan is bringing that Vic up. Now they're being fired at. 
Alpha is moving to Alpha 1. I didn't mean to do that to you. I'm gonna start planning to try oh, to get these Vicks out of here. Ah, uh, look, as look at that. Only the medic's alive, staying in cover by the smoke. He's about to get outflanked on the right, being shot at, and he actually went down. So yeah, that blue four reinforcement uh, FIA group. It's basically Charlie come Bravo, around. My medic just went down. And now they're going to comb over on the other Copy. side where um, they are reporting contact. AO, uh, we're going to try to push up. But they took out that off-road. Position. Uh, medic is marked. Comms is key. Let's uh, give this other group. Beware, they're still taking contact. I'm going to throw three Danger simple close. assault teams uh, at them. I'm going to have them kind of expand around. Give these guys something to do. Twelve units shouldn't be too difficult. Yeah, these guys are now flanking around. There's still five casualties they could revive. So they're quickly sending in. They got a medic behind three people. But will three people be enough to pave the way for the medic to push through? It's difficult to say. Anyone's game at this point. I didn't even realize we had two op bands. Group goes down. I'll play something that the exact to the down. Jeez, that marksman is outright spraying at Torch right there. Torch manages to down them both. Nice. Meanwhile, these four men. I'm gonna say they're gonna push over here. Alpha, please be aware that against that contact. Team in that direction. Copy. Let's see if something like that works, if we're able to get a truck out of there. No, he just went straight for... <laughs> Sorry, an RPG go off. That might have been this guy. Nope, that was a player base RPG. Ah, uh, see, now we're seeing, starting to see some of them bleed out. But it looks like they actually were able to get to the other medic in time. That's probably the most valuable player they could have gotten up unless there was a squad lead. But even then, I'd debate that the medic, or I'd argue, excuse me, that definitely the medic was the most important call right there. Charlie, come on. ETA on reinsert. Reinserts are on the way. Delta, this is Zeka. We got contact northeast, northeast. On the main road, uh, sorry, north, west, north, north. Yeah, so the AI is not smart enough to maneuver out of here. Otherwise, I'm seeing some casualties start to stack up. That was by probably the last guy, and he's brought back. Meanwhile, FIA reinforcements coming in. Target down. There, but otherwise, again, just some small amount of force to kind of balance out for these guys. They've got a freaking 50 cal. That thing can pretty Probably much murder affected. all those guys, as we saw over here earlier. It's not really that much of a challenge. Bravo, still fully effective. Alpha, fully effective. Oh, he set the hold fire. Hold on. Alpha, we, we are moving after the cast. Machine. That's so why you don't alpha stop. Marker. Just because he stops firing at you doesn't... Ah, I love this player base, but good god, could they do some stupid shit? Oh, fuck. Here's a much better route we could have been using. Well, that's my fault. Alpha got ice on one times water truck. Foiled again. Solid copy. Water truck is marked on map. My god, please stop being retarded. Just go. Just go down that route and you will be fine. 
Delta, this so is Echo. We are unable go, to we? move up to the position right now without exposing ourselves heavily. So again, we're gonna start pulling out units. I set him to walking, is he actually gonna walk with it? Yeah, there we go. See that? That's Ace right there. That's how Ace does it. So they're gonna come up to the cache or they're gonna I hope they don't lose their momentum. That would be unfortunate. Alpha is leaving the water truck and moving up towards the cache. So I think they're trying to secure the water truck. Meanwhile I got two guys over here. I'm going to have them comb that corner and then have them pull back. Actually, no, we'll just do a direct pull back. We'll let them get in a few more shots and then they'll try to run away. Delta, this Perfect. is like a be advised. The contact is flagging to our northwest at this time. Copy that. Delta is moving to the northwest as well. We'll probably keep in contact with the that. You did not just get out. Good night. House always wins. Bye. You drove a Vic out by yourself. I don't know what you were doing, but hopefully that worked out for you. Now the 50 cals. We got the statics ahead. Northwest. Any force response. Of course he does. Wow, I hit that guy in the corner. Charlie, come on. Go ahead. I've got the two effectives still in the AO, guarding the water truck. Oh, he got instantly shot right there. Good job. Torch really making the smartest moves here. Definitely a shout-out should go to him. Otherwise, they're going to get what they needed. Squad member is supporting one food truck moving to the north. One food truck moving north. Damn. Out of it. I guess he just didn't like Teacher there, because there were a lot of different guys to get a shot at, but... <laughs> teacher's first. Come on, this is Bravo. Go ahead. We have found a ammo truck with weaponry in it uh, at the cash point. Solid copy. Secure the area. Make sure nothing escapes or goes in. Yeah, that's ammo. That's area the cash. Uh, secured at this time. That is indeed the cash. Solid copy. Was the route able to bring that truck down to the main road? Yes, that will be a problem. So they just gotta bring that back, contact. and otherwise they should be good. Negative contact's pretty deep in the dense jungle. Oh, look, they're finally Monty, getting a drone up. This truck, uh, okay. back to base or to the outpost. So I'm gonna prep this AO here. To the outpost. Copy that. But, uh, otherwise, yep. Should be good. They're still shooting. Still trying to take on this one guy who's just trying to get out of here. <laughs> Alright, not bad. Alpha is holding 360 at the cash point. Delete the bodies, but otherwise that should be alright. So yeah, they just need to bring these Vicks back to their cash, and that will be the end of mission two. So yeah, not bad. Uh, yeah, so here's the deal. They do have enough food to continue the campaign. Uh, overall, they still have two water trucks 
and two things of food right now. So they still will last uh, up to two weeks before they need to really get more, but they were supposed to get a lot more today. <laughs> And they didn't really. Furthermore, I think there's a third water Vic uh, that was at the outpost that they've secured. Yep, back here. But, um, yeah, out of all the potential stuff, we just got to see if they're able to get the car back correctly. Do you want to uh, have the weaponry bring to the uh, base? So otherwise, I do have this AO to prep, and this is where the fun is going to begin. So I'm going to start off by putting down... Bring it to the outpost we have just taken. Some Asian sibs. There's a method to the madness. Alpha is returning by foot to the FOB. Alright, Ghost has got a drone up in the air. We'll see what we can do from here. Put a few guys in, and now we're going to stack some CSAT as part of the third mission. We're not going to use Desert CSAT, no, I want to use the Pacific Orion variant, however the hell we say that word. And they're actually going to be set as recon units. Go ahead. We also bring in a water truck with us. Because this is all part of a listening post. Well done. And if we look in here, this is where they're going to be able to get their light combat helmets, which is the, you know, next stage in line four helmets and that'll help prevent a lot of the headshots that I've been going along. We've also got a cache of boats here that aren't going to be grabbable but they will automatically be looted towards the end. So I'm going to put up a few more sentries. Delta 2 Echo contact neutralized. And we're going to have a Viper team. Repeat Delta. Contact in the woods to the northwest neutralized. Operating in the distance Copy. to reinforce. Ah, otherwise, oh, simple alpha. listening post. Should be okay. Not bad. I'm also going to put a recon patrol. Go ahead, Alpha. We are moving back to base with one times truck. Or oh, outpost, I mean. Oh, jeez, what did they do? Solid cup. Ah, it looks okay. So that's ready to go. Not decrypted, we've... Charlie, come on. Go ahead, Charlie. My guys are coming back from the cache in one technical with a uh, LMG, and they've got a uh, 50 cal folded up in the back as well. Solid copy. Enemy technical above Charlie reinsert. All right, so this mission... Again, not meant to be hard, but they still need to do the Zerg mentality. But it's going to be difficult because we've had a lot of potential boats they can loot. And two are in the southern place close to their main base. And two are on a completely opposite side of the map. So how they funnel units in is uh, going to have to, of course, be a funnel. Because if they get left behind, that mission is going to fail. And but... Echo. Little reinforcements. There's only the Viper team that's in the field right now is going to be called in. So otherwise, not too much. But they secure that area. They'll be able to get any CSAT gear that they uh, want from the bodies. And then the light combat helmet will be added to the arsenal for next time. There's a squad of guys coming in now. For the swarm, right? <laughs> and then the civilians there are just also guys. I specifically took them from the Asian section because they're meant to be the Chinese workers that you know CSAT Pacific faction takes from the CSAT side or the Chinese side of CSAT, and uh, they're just helping to manage that little listening post. So that should be a good amount Most of time for that objective. Come on, channel ASAP. And have they secured? That truck yet. Not yet. 
What did they do? They only got half of it. What did they do? How did... That had to have been done in transport. Because when I saw it, it was both yellow, which means they both were fine. I mean, the mission is technically complete, but... Goes to Charlie, how you doing? Yeah. 